what's up everyone and welcome back to the channel um today we're going to come to you with a short video it's um it's just a little trick that i know of um i'm pretty sure other people know about it i don't think i've ever seen uh any videos put out about it i'm sure it's been mentioned um i just wanted to make this short video just to show you um that it is possible and um i know people are grinding their 24x trophies and this might come in handy for that um so it actually is a way to keep all of your items whenever you die in a game um I don't, I haven't, I don't think I've ever seen like someone put out an official video about this. I think I've seen it mentioned. I know other people know about it, but I just wanted to make a video about it real quick. Um, as you can see here, I have 95 of each item, right? 95 of um, every available item. I just went ahead and bought up to 95 just to make it. I think I had the most was, was 95 of an item, so I just went ahead and bought 95 of everything. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and hop into game here real quick. Um, there's not much to this, so we'll just go ahead and add a whole thing. Obviously got a full list of uh, gear here. Uh, we'll just hop in the Tanglewood and we'll throw it on, let me just throw it on Nightmare, it doesn't really matter what you have it on. Uh, it works in custom, it works in normal settings, it works in big maps, small maps, multiplayer, single player, whatever, it works in all of it. So here we are. And I really, you really, I mean I'm not going to grab anything, but obviously you, you, you know, you'd be loading into your normal game like this. Uh, and um, you know, dying happens, right? So. You know, and not everyone has money to die a bunch. Um, why am I grabbing this? Anyway, uh, I'm just gonna break the cursed item immediately. Whoa, is that blown? Bad. Um, what is it? Don't be cards. I should have put on specific cursed item. It's alright though. Don't be this. Okay, it's not. Oh my god, it's the last one. So it's dull. Okay. So as you saw, I put in a full a, uh, a full truck of, of you know full inventory of, of items, and here we go. So this is all you have to do, right? Um, obviously, just loaded up a random game of Nightmare. Um, you can do this in multiplayer. You can do it with your friends. Um, I really, the, really, I think the place that it's going to have the most value is the 24x multiplier because you know when you're trying to get your trophy, you're probably going to burn through a bunch of items. Um, those aren't supposed to be there. Um, anyway. Uh, yeah, anyway, let's just go ahead and do it real quick. Alright, so all you do is, obviously I'm going to get killed here, right? And normally when you get killed, obviously you lose all your items, right? So we started with 95 of everything. Ghost, hello? So we're just going to get grabbed here. Oh, two bad grabs. Escape, leave game. And do it before the death animation finishes, right? And you go back to your items. And you still have 95 of everything, okay? So all you literally all you have to do is just, whenever the ghost grabs you, you want to escape leave game before your death animation finishes if your death animation finishes that's when your items are taken okay so as long as you leave before your you know before the hands are done grabbing you and you're, you're done in the death room you get to keep all of your items uh we'll do it one more time just i don't know skeptics whatever add all the items again right one of everything tanglewood uh actually we'll let's throw it on custom real quick and just put on uh put on the the mirror so i can just snap it real quick uh And again, I I know some people do know about this, but I don't think I've ever seen like a like a video come out about it. Maybe there has been. I'm just gonna put another one out. All right, so again, we're just gonna speed death run, basically. I can see this having a spot, and you know, I mean, mainly for the people who don't have a lot of money or they want to conserve their items and stuff. Maybe you're doing solo. My game is dying. Uh. But yeah, outside of that, you know, you're not going to be leaving games with your friends or anything. Maybe you will. Maybe maybe you're in a lobby and you just you put all the items in and you got to go or something and you die. So, all right. So we're just going to snap it. Wait, it's faster if I do this right because it's 20% every flip. Whoa, it's quiet. Speed death run again, naked man, and then just leave in the middle of the death animation, right? And again, we're gonna have 95 of all items. So basically, you can just never lose any items. Um, I do think that they'll maybe fix this eventually. It's been in the game for a very long time, surprised they haven't fixed it already. It kind of makes me wonder, 
how many people actually do know about it because I think they would have fixed it by now if enough people knew about it. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to put this video out in case you didn't know about this bug, glitch, whatever you want to call it. Um, it is a good way to hold on to your items. Maybe you don't have enough um, you know, money to attempt the Apocalypse Challenges um, if you want to get your gold, your silver, and your bronze trophy, um, but you don't have the items to um, you know, throw at it because you're probably going to die a couple times or maybe a lot of times depending on how good you are at the game um, while attempting these, these challenges. Um, so yeah, you can definitely use this to your advantage. They are doing the progression update, but again, um, you know, that might be three, four, f who knows, five months out from now. Um, we're in, what, 8.0? I think they said we have 8.1 to get through, and then we have the progression update. So we've had this update for about a month now. So then we'll have the next update for maybe two to three months, and then we might have the progression update. So who's to say how long we're actually going to be, uh, you know, without the progression update. So you could use this for potentially quite a long time. Um, and who's to say they even patch it whenever the progression update comes out? It's been in the game since um, the inception, since I know. It's been in the game since the beginning of the game that you can do this. You can just leave and keep your items, and they still have never patched it. So maybe they patch it by then, maybe they don't. But um, if they do, you can still use it up until then, and um, you can definitely save yourself a lot of money while doing these challenges. You can practice looping. You can do crazy settings with your friends. Um, there's a ton of stuff you can do with it. Obviously, you can just keep your items. You basically have infinite items. Um, so yeah, I think we'll wrap it up here, and um, thank you for watching.